Hey guys, so welcome back. My name is Driss from DrissMastery.com and welcome back to another WordPress tutorial. So in this tutorial we're going to be learning about the excerpt. So without further ado, let's get started. So at the moment, if we go into our index.php, we are using the function called the content. Okay. Now let's go into our blog here. And you can see here that uh, we are outputting everything that's inside a post. So if we make a new post here, let's call this post excerpt test. I'm just going to uh, input some lorem text. So this, I'm gonna publish it, and when I refresh the page, you can see here I get the whole blog post. And sometimes I don't want that. I just want maybe a few words. Okay. Now there are numerous ways to do this. Um, I'll show you a few. The first way to do this is to go back into your post, and let's say you only want the first paragraph. Well. Just click on this insert read more tag, update it, refresh the page, and then you can see now we have a a more tag, a uh, more button. When, when you click on that, it goes into our post. So that's one way of doing it, but however, all the other posts don't have that more button unless you go into it. So let's see a more um, more lo logical way. Let's just get rid of this. Um, so we'll leave that for now. Let's just delete everything. Okay. So th there's another way of doing that, and that's going into our code and adding a function in our functions.php. Now this function is going to be called custom. Uh, custom excerpt length and I'm going to make a new function here function oops function and I'm going to call this custom excerpt length and in this function all we're going to do is just return a value now this value is how much how many words do you want to uh, output? Say you want to output only 25. Okay. And then we're going to add a filter. Add filter. And we're going to use excerpt length. And this is a default WordPress function. And we're going to replace that with this function we just created. So now, if we refresh the page, nothing is going to happen. This is because it is still outputting the content. Let's go into our next.php. Let's output the excerpt. Or I think it's... Let's see what this does. Yep, the excerpt. So now, we have a little bit of this. There's, uh, it says like kind of like a read more, but there's no link. Well, you could just click on the promo link right there. But let's see what happens if we go into our functions.php and we remove this custom excerpt length. Now, it, would, it wouldn't disappear, it'll just increase the word count. And I think the default WordPress length, excerpt length, I think 55. I'm not too sure, probably not, but we don't want too much, so we're just going to leave it at 25. Let's add a read more link. So after the accept, we're going to have a, a div, and we're going to have a class called button, and an a uh, href with PHP tags of the permalink. Read more. 
And let's style the button now. Let's go style. Uh, let's put this in typography. And we're just going to do font. No. Padding. Oops. Padding 15 pixels. Background color of. Let's give it a nice blue. And a border radius of around five pixels. Let's see how this looks like. Refresh the page. And there you can see we have a bit more. That looks a bit big. Let's just fix this up. Um, color. Make it inline block. Okay, whoops. My bad. Make sure we put in our color in the anchor tag. Right. And there you get to see this little read more tag. Let's go for a bit smaller. Uh, yeah, so you can customize that button any how you like. At the moment, it looks alright. It's not that good. But I'm just gonna add a little bit more. By the way, I'm doing this. I'm making all this up as we speak. So I'm probably not gonna be that prepared. <laughs> but I think that'll look a bit better. Yep, yeah, that's good. I'm happy with that. So we have a read more button, and when you click on it, it brings us to the excerpt, the uh, the full content. Yeah, so, um, thanks for watching. And in the next video, we'll be covering how to make a featured image. So we can have an image right here, or here. Um, yeah, so, see ya.